ready for anything. But it's got to be good. I also forgot that there's, like, no damn sound in this section here. Well, yeah. So that's going to be interesting. All right. So, hey there, guys. Welcome back. It's How been long? a while. It's been, like, been what, week. two weeks? One week? Uh, I think uh, two weeks, I think. The calm before the storm. I think we should have prepared for the biggest battle in their lives. Yeah. Hello, Daniel. And hello, Joey. Time to eradicate things at Monsteropolis. <laughs> wow, I'm actually surprised Joey's even here considering the fact he hasn't shown up in a while. But then again, the boy's been busy with school and... He's been busy. Knowledge that's understandable. stuff. That's I mean, understandable. Yeah, that's whatever. Also, thank you, are for the host. Thank you so very much, so. I mean, everyone's been busy, yeah. Ours has been busy, too. Hey, I can finally actually read these. Welcome, T. Okay. Welcome, T. Hi, yes. So, hello, Lucy Gamer. <laughs> I can't wait for Pika to fight the me gunner. Oh, yeah, that was the thing. Also, Mateo's hosting. Thank you. Thank you, Mateo. Oh, wait, is everybody coming here just to watch me die? <laughs> I mean, maybe. Lovely. Anyways, you said that the you first. Oh, that's interesting. It's a force field. Anyways, you said mm -hmm. where you can fight most of the enemies? Right after the lab. Oh. Usually the area. You don't get the belt area. That's where I usually fight monsters. And Mateo said, yeah, pretty much. Fair enough. Just watching you just, hope, just to see you die. That's very understandable. <laughs> Same thing with Lucy. He's like, yeah, mostly, yeah. Interesting. You ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Chunch in for me. I'm impressed. This is also loud. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. While you were busy doing your ahem <coughs> thing, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a place where you'll never get to them. Probably in a secret lab. Decided not to fight you. My, my. She really is the only smart one, isn't she? Oh, how sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, T-O-O-B-A-D. This world needs stars more than it needs corpse. Toodles! Oh, okay. Toodles. Just gonna, just gonna run for me, aren't ya? Oh, <laughs> or so you say you still scare him when you play as me, Gunner? <laughs> Listen... I don't know what to say. <laughs> uh, not quite, Brandon. It's just a little, like, update slash preview of Chapter 2 of Delta Room. But it's not quite out yet. He's just giving us a little tease of what to expect for, well, more so screenshots of Chapter 2 and some sound song bits. Also hope Jack is here because he kind of did a dick move on our Discord, but whatever. <laughs> you want to know what he did? What? Friggin' put in Tobby Fox or something saying that Delta oh. Rune Chapter 2 is out. And I'm like, Oh, you are... I did not see that. No, 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 no. It was a fake. It was a fake tweeter. Tweet, tweeter? Twitter. So, yeah. I, w I woke up and I saw that. I was like, Oh, okay, never mind. Everybody else is saying it's fake. Jack, you're a dick. Wait, was it? Hmm? No. no well,. Well, me and the chapter two thing being out, like no, 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 like, no, it's not out. No, it's not. No, no, it's, I know. I didn't see any tweet about that. I just saw like tease from the official Toby Fox. No, this just Jack found a fake Toby Fox account and oh, it okay. said Toby Fox, and he posted it on Discord, and then he was like, "Ha ha, I got you all, bitches!" And I'm like, "Okay, whatever." And no, there wasn't a trailer. It was just like a, a, a screenshot. Like something new from the from from chapter two. If, if if you look at the official account until we talk, you'll see for yourself. Jesus. Who is Jack? Jack is a friend of ours. Um, Brandon Donato. Yeah. He's the one I keep having emote wars with. He's a cool <laughs> dude. Hey, unwound. Yo. After a long day of hard work, it's time to slip some souls. Yeah. They're dust. <laughs> The chapter two was actually a link to Area Fifty One, the hentai game. <laughs> oh dear. Is it Area Fifty One hentai? You know what? Don't answer that. You, you didn't fall for it, Daniel. I honestly didn't see it. I. Well, me again. It was on Discord, wasn't it? 
Well, no, the thing is, is that it was around on Twitter, but the thing is, is that I saw it on Discord first if I saw it anywhere else. Oh, uh, I, I actually didn't see it. I, I kind of missed it. <laughs> I saw the official one. The official news. Which was actually pretty funny, and I wouldn't mind till we join us like that. Because I just saw it this morning, and I'm like, oh, some, some news, and he... You know, made a long tweet about his progress and all that. <laughs> now like, did we get like said, hmm? Hmm? No, go. No, he said like he wants to get it out as soon as possible, but at the same time he said, you know, he doesn't want to rush it. Oh well, yeah, like in all fairness, like take your time with the game as much as you want. Like, I mean, hell, if you want to make it like better than Undertale, go nuts. Mhm. Mm so hello, Kiwi six twelve, plain weren't. Plain wearing Toho hat, Remelia. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a game. Uh, I heard of the Toho stuff a bit. Don't know much about it, but I aware of that name. Also, in other news, Ash won the Pokemon League. <laughs> Rejoice! Yeah. That's <laughs> now, what you need, experiment. Now the curse is finally lifted. We can now live our lives. <laughs> now he can age. I still love that tweet. So the truth is now revealed. Our next protagonist will be a new one. I just also love the fact that how he was so surprised that he won. My friend posted it to her Instagram and I was like, you, you what may be forced it with Topi Fox, also known as Retac Radicalation. Also, hello. Ashton there, finally Jenna. aged. Hello there, everybody. Good evening. Hello. Welcome to my death. <laughs> Twitch was having issues earlier, but we are good. For now, anyways. Yeah, I think we're good. At least that's what the Capcom announced another Mega Man game. That is true. There's a lot of good, a lot of announcements happening this week. Everybody, there is hope. A lot of good things. A lot of good things. What's that? In other news, the Amazon rainforest has finally been put out of the fire. Now we can finally Aww. rejoice and have our oxygen again. Yay! Ash, when he won. Yo, what? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, real? Just watched it on CBC and I said them to um, get back at OG Locket, but that stopped me for all 20 seconds. <laughs> Is that saying wait for real? For, wait for what? For what? Forgot what you were talking about. What were we talking about? Wait, the Twitch thing? I think I don't know. <laughs> Twitch plays Undertale. Oh <laughs> no, they no. I I wish Mateo for the Amazon thing. Like I wish that oh, was true. Oh that. If uh, like I'm expecting that to be the next news for good news, please. Yeah. John Cena. <laughs> Which John? <laughs> Our John or that. John John? Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, experiment said that he was watching John TV's interview. How was that? Was he nervous? Was he balding? <laughs> was he wearing his hat unprofessional like? Oh. Hopefully, the next Mega Man game is X9 or Legends 3. Uh, Legends 3, uh, I'm not gonna really hold my breath for that one, but if it does come into fruition, great. But I'm expecting an X9. John Johnson, Cave Johnson. Oh yeah, that's right. Link's Awakening comes out next Friday. Yay! Oh good. Experiment's probably like, when the fuck you get in bed in Metroid 2? <laughs> so apparently this Nintendo Switch Lite comes out on that day too. Ah uh, yeah. Let me use that to stream. <laughs> yeah, how are you gonna stream from that? This is technically all handheld. I'll find a way. <laughs> we can always find ways. Jonathan Wheeler, Jonathan Joestar, Johnny Joestar, <laughs> Johnny Bravo, where is the X3? <laughs> that a Mega Man game? The DS one? Yeah. Okay. I mean, that, at least that game is coming. I believe the DS games. Now I think we actually have, except for the Mega Man Legends series, we now have almost every single Mega Man at our disposal to play. I say almost because there are technically still some in the in the shadows because Wily Wars comes out on is in the Genesis Mini. Or the Mega Drive Mini. Ugh. 
Um, I think the other room also is fine too. Oh, okay. Well, they're, oh, they're so all like, treadmills. Okay, if so you I want can, to go right, one so room I can stop closer. running around in circles and making myself throw up. Because the core doesn't really have any random encounter. It has three spots. You know that long bridge where you encounter enemies? That's like the only monsters you encounter in the core. Actually, I'm going back down. It was actually a lot faster. That one takes too long. Oh, okay, fine. That's fine. Also, the song is just slow down. I love it. I mean, I kind of don't mind it too much, but no, I, the, the, the original. That's fine. <laughs> you can shoot with the USB uh, to HDMI. Boom, see? I told you there was a way. Oh, well, I mean, look, I, I assume with a lot of handhelds, it's actually more difficult to stream, okay? I mean, that's a point, like... I mean, I'm not planning on ever doing that for the Wii U pad whenever I let's play any Wii U games. But how do you go about doing that? Somebody explain to me. I have no idea. Because I know Chugga would have it, but he spent a lot of money for that. Okay, continue. What were you yeah. saying? Is the Genesis Mini Model 1 going to catch fire more often than the Model 2, though? Mega Man and Base should be nowhere near current on consoles. <laughs> Oh wait, that right, that is one game that still hasn't been re-released. <laughs> Can't remember off the top of my head. Normally I just grind in Hotland that that blitz through the core. That experiment said. I just remember there were like three enemies in the core, but because there's no random encounters in the core. Ooh, that was bad taking off my glasses. Shit. Right, because Hotland core are the same region technically, right? Uh yeah, they're technically the same region. The same area, the, the core is still in the Hotland area. It, it still counts towards the, the total in the area, so technically, yeah. That's so, a little SNES. Whoa, wait, what's going on? Uh, no, I'm talking about like the does the core um, count as a Hotland thing? Yes, it does. It does count towards the, t the total. Uh, how many you killed in this area? Yeah, because I think uh, you find Metaton at the end of that, right? Yeah. For the Wii U gamepad, you can do it super easy with the Wii U homebrew and swap DRC light. Um, Snooze can attest to that. Alright. I don't know how much money Emil spent on getting this gamepad modded, but it was a total waste, I'll tell you that much. Oh. Wait, what do you need help for, SNES? Zombie Dragon is being a bitch right now. What are you playing? Are you playing Monster Hunter? Alright. I'm gonna message him later. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> music moves slower than usual. Also, hey y'all. Hey rocks! Uh, yeah, the music is actually moving slower than usual. Because it's, well, genocide. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, you're, you're, you're hearing right, don't worry. Arsus put down Iceborne. Does anybody really want Mega Man and Base pulled into modern consoles? I don't know. Do people want that? Say, wait, so, well, I mean, hey, there's some people that probably like Mega Man and Base. I don't know who those people are, but I'm pretty sure they exist. <laughs> SNES says no, Brandon says no. Damn, never mind, I guess they don't exist. I take it back. <laughs> Forgot how creepy music is, let's get further in this route. Yeah, the music's actually pretty creepy at times. I mean, I don't mind the Hotland or the core slow down, but it's not my music to listen to while I'm playing the game. <laughs> Yummy delicious genocide. <laughs> yes, Monster Hunter <laughs> dealing with Val has Zack and he's being a right pain with things despite blowing his space sky high. Actually, isn't he traveling around in other areas now? He's not just in that one area anymore? Because I think I heard my brother say that because my brother for some reason loves to go out and look at fucking spoilers because he ain't got nothing better to do. Uh, Monster Hunter? Yeah. I haven't even beaten the main scenario, so I don't know what the hell I'm looking forward to. All no, I keep finding fucking subspecies, which are very entertaining to fight, but also quite fucking annoying. <laughs> yeah. You know, I find some of the subspecies easier than others, but that's besides the point. Thank God for that. League. <laughs> I don't even know how many monkeys they have for last. Uh, uh, I'll say point too far. Well, I think there's another one up ahead, I believe. Too far. After the, I think, no, after this one, I think there's another save point. Too far. 
Well then. I was not keeping count. I think the worst thing the worst thing about Super Kirby Clash is missing the platinum clear time by a little split second. Lucid Gamer! I know that feeling too well. I've been trying to get platinum on all the missions or all the quests I'm doing thus far that I can actually beat. Yeah, she has been playing. Yeah, she's been playing the game more than I play Final Fantasy XIV. It's kind of like scary. I'm like at level 54 right now, I believe. <sighs> so yeah. Oh, we got 26 doodads left. Also, my favorite role in that game is being the B mage. When it's destroying a plane, like kill hole for us as it crashes down. Nah, I don't man. know. I think the plane is small. Maybe. Mm -mm. 26 more corpses to the pile! Yeet! Luckily enough, this is actually the last time we have to kill anything. And the rest of it is basically straightforward boss fights. And by boss fight, meaning two. Because we only got two more boss fights in this game. In this route. <laughs> Trying to get the gold, so I can high road. You. <laughs> so Trav reminded me of Larry Boy. Who is Larry Boy? Who is Larry, and why is he boy? <laughs> Straight for <forward>, quote unquote. <laughs> Platinum time 15 seconds. Clear time 15.49 seconds. Uh Wait, I'm dumb. I said that there's two bosses left. I'm sorry, I keep forgetting Muffet. Oh yeah. I you uh... want you wanna know why I forget her? It's mainly because of the fact that like she does make a sort of remembrance in the story in she... the true pacifist. She's not She's story. Not, yeah, she's relevant. Yeah, that's the problem. That's why I always forget her. She I doesn't really have. About her and I like her. Yeah, like she doesn't have that much dialogue. I find, and she's just there. Not only that, you can skip her boss fight just by eating a friggin' spider donut, and then she just leaves. And like, oh, okay, well, whatever, bye. With Larry, Larry the cucumber, Larry the cable guy, boy. Larry, oh, Larry from Badger Tales. Speaking of Larry from Veggie Tales, this has, this has nothing to do with what I'm about to ask people. But how's yeah. how was everybody's weekend? <laughs> what kind of segue is that? Uh, segue that doesn't really matter. Speaking of Larry, I had a dream that Larry the Lobster killed SpongeBob's parents. What kind of dream <laughs> did you have? What triggered that? Still have the donut. I don't know if you have the donut anymore. I think you ate it. I don't think it really matters. No, we think... still have it, but we're gonna kill Muffet anyway, so. Yeah, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> what am I gonna do? Eat the, eat the damn donut, then she leaves, and then it's like, well, there goes my genocide route. She's the only one that lives. <laughs> oh, the reason Muffet was kind of forgettable because she was tacked on near the end of development. That is oh, true. I mean, I guess that makes sense considering the fact she doesn't really do a whole lot. Oh, not really, sadly. Hey, her music is really catchy. Even though it's just a remix of the Mad Dummy and Mew Mew. Even though we listen more of the Mad Dummy than the Spider Dance. Well, because Spider Dance repeats too fast, I find, compared to the Mad Dummy. I listen to more the Mad Dummy or the Mad Mew song. So they're pretty much, almost, they're pretty much the same. I mean, to be but fair, if you want a better, well, if you want a better version of of Spider Dance, just listen to Mad Mew Mew. Yeah, Mad Mew Mew. Even though I I do like both songs. Oh, that's. I mean, I don't like spiders either, Ramir, but uh, Muffet, she doesn't need to burn. <laughs> Busy doing final parts of their arcade project, won a Mario Party stream last night. Kilo. Oh, yeah, because you were asking how everyone was doing. My weekend was, eh. So I made some real um, buttery grilled cheese sandwiches early today, so that sounds yummy. Turns out it's a temple, it's a lot faster. Yee. Yeah. You eat it, she likes you, then you crack her over the head with a frying pan to be an asshole. Oh, another <laughs> dickish way to <laughs> do fights. She eats the spider and she's like, oh, you're good. I shall spare you. <laughs> and she dies. <laughs> and you have weird dreams unwound. <laughs> I mean, don't we all have weird dreams? I... Interruption. <laughs> Anyways, I heard a knock, I'm like, interruption, yeah! 
Anyways, yeah, I heard of um, Adriana's version of Spider Dance. Actually, really good. I like her lyrics for it. <laughs> spiders are evil. They want to be the. Wait, I already said this already. My point is, spiders are evil. I mean, Muppet does try to kill you, but after she realizes. You know, hey, you're a good human. She doesn't leave you the donut, she spares you in the fight sequence. Continues to tell you either leave or kill her. Oh, really? Oh. Oh, so she doesn't leave, okay. Oh, but she, she does continue the fight, though. Oh, okay. Weird. <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, I mean. Uh, I don't know how many more I can 20. 20? Uh, we're halfway there. <laughs> halfway there. Halfway there. Um, when does it stop? Uh. Like, what's the stopping point should I, should I avoid? Um, uh, well, when you get up to Metaton, pretty much. Oh, okay, so the core, then. Yeah, that door. The same room that you bought him in the you know, past. And I think what we'll do, we'll probably get to five, and then we'll leave this area, and then we'll start to just continue as proper. Okay, because I really don't know how if there are any more. I know there's, like, three in the core, but I don't know if there's any more after that. If the three, if do those they, three gotta, count? Yeah, I think those three count, I believe. The one that you go over, like, like a bridge to hit the switch. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like Spooter Knife and Spider-Man. <laughs> Look at the spiders. <laughs> Corrin, the RG guard. Oh yeah, that's right, the royal guards count too. Oh, okay, so, yeah. Okay, so when she get the five, cause I... Oh, and Muppet, I think she does count. So how many do I need to keep left before I can just leave? <laughs> Ten? Five? I would say five, maybe? I'm, I'm sure Muppet counts. Muppet should a... count, considering so, the fact uh, that she is a boss. Six. You can also twist the knife on that fight by getting them to admit their love for one another and then murder them. <laughs> no, experiment, that's sad. Wait, Muppet? No, for the Royal Guards. Oh. Like, you know, when, after they confess to each other and all that, you just kill them right there. I'm like, I'd rather just kill them before they get to that part because it just makes you even sad. I mean, hey, uh, I would say this, at least playing the PC version of Undertale actually makes it easier to do certain things. Mm -hmm. Like one particular fight that I was trying to actually work my ass off to actually be able to be prepared for. You guys know the fight. Yeah, that fight. Yeah. That fight. I actually went out of my way to look for a friggin' video of how to actually get to that fight without me actually doing the damn route. And, uh, yeah, that's exactly how I pictured it was gonna be. <laughs> Nine as fuck! <laughs> experiment did it out on his playthrough. Of course! <laughs> An experiment! <laughs> well, she tried to fight you to get you to help her because she's a bit extreme in the neutral passage run, but in Genocide, she acts as the second to last game before you get to Sans, essentially saying, No, fuck you, you need to be stopped. But everybody's been saying that to me. I remember missing one enemy at the core, and that enemy made me reset the entire genocide run. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, that's a lot of patience for genocide. Like, you really gotta roam around and kind of wait until a random encounter comes to you. Ow. Or you can play the PC version and use one thing, fight Sans, say fuck you, and then just finish the genocide route like that. Yeah, just find the code and just fight Sans. Now that I think about it, with all those, I think there's like so many of them with the save point that kind of just like send you to those boss fights. I could potentially just do a damn boss rush with that. You could. Meaning I don't have to actually do the game all the time just to get to certain <laughs> bosses. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Meaning I can fight Asgore as much as I want now. Or Asgore, whichever you prefer. Oh uh, yeah, or Asgore, whichever one. Like, Not if yeah. Mo Mega Flower, he can go eat no eat dicks. Speaking of Omega Flower, I actually got my ass kicked by that dickhead. I, I yeah, still... No, no, remember when I... No, I'm talking about when I played it um, before, off screen. Like, I uh, love how I played it off screen, I kept dying, but for oh, some yeah, reason yeah, yeah. in my um, stream version, I beat him on my first try. I was like, alright, how the hell did I win? <laughs> how did I beat you the first time? <laughs> oh, man. For the record, I actually never seen anything of the Omega Flower fight, so... Happy light to make the video before me and slowly twist the knife. Me when I do the genocide rapper of this game, which I never actually did. Oh. I mean, I, 
like, I don't blame you if you don't do the genocide route, because it is actually pretty hard. Look, we're doing this because we're doing all, we did all the routes. We did, we did normal, we did pacifist, and now we're doing genocide, and then we'll get to Deltarune, and then you guys can go ahead and sugarcoat and cream over that. Well, not spoil it, though. Well, not spoil it, obviously, yeah, not but you can, you, 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 can cre you can cream Deltarune. over that. After I'm done with Deltarune. <laughs> Recording curse. Oh uh, no, it was just playing on his own time. No, I wasn't recording. I was just literally just playing on my own time at the time. Yeah. I'll cheese it instead. Thanks, Kappa. <laughs> I don't like killing my friends, but I know how to take them down the easiest way possible. Actually, now that I think about it. Uh... <laughs> Cause I know like the quote unquote maximum level that we actually get to before we get to Sans is 19. Mm -hmm. I don't, that's such a weird number. Why is it not 20? That actually upsets me. Cause if you, cause you level up in that fight, you'll be 21. <laughs> you'll be legal. What? <laughs> <laughs> Did you even get experience from killing Sans? Yeah, you do. Cause you level up to 20. Oh, okay. Never mind. I guess you get to 20 there. All right. That's yeah. stupid. Whatever. Yeah. Yep, TFA, yep. That's dumb. I don't <laughs> like it. Actually, that's a point. They said that you can keep grinding, but is there a point to it considering Sans can still kick your ass? Is it for like HP's sake? Because no offense, your HP is like 96 well, and that's I it. Think, no, I think it's more so in order to fight Sans and have to kill everybody. Never that. But yeah, but there's also like some enemies that still show up, like that Glade dude and something uh, they else. Don't, they don't count. They don't give you experience? Uh, well, I mean, they don't count towards the genocide thing. Yeah, no, that's what I mean. But, but they can keep coming back, though. Uh, I don't know. I, I really don't know. <laughs> Sans gives you dank memes. <laughs> Fun fact for Nick, because I don't think he actually knows the name of the songs in this game. The name of the song that plays when you play Photoshop or a Mega Flow is called Your Best Nightmare. I thought it was Your Worst Nightmare. Oh, oh, wait, is, was it? It? is it your best nightmare? I, I mean, I looked at the saw before, but it's been a while since I actually seen what what the name was. Ah. I always, I like, I, I always forget the title of that song. No, we already know, I know what the final obviously. part is finale. Maybe it is nightmare. I don't remember. No, it has night. I know it has nightmare in its name. I know it has nightmare in it. Oh, I can't remember. <laughs> Oh, it's check it out. It's not one of those songs that I listen to. I listen to it. I know you do. I actually like the song. Oh, it is your best nightmare? Huh. How come I don't I know Nightmare was in it, but how come I can't remember that title? Because you just said it yourself, you don't listen to it a whole lot. No, I mean I mean yeah, but I, I, I see it all the time, like on like on a side on YouTube. Well then, I don't know what to tell you. Your best nightmare since he's your best friend. It only seems bright. He's your best nightmare. <laughs> nightmare on Dank Street. But we don't know that. We don't know if he's our best friend. We just assume <laughs> that he's just some random flower to just trying to kill us because he's a oh, dick. Oh, since we know, I'm pretty sure everyone's familiar with pacifists. I'm pretty sure we all know. Oh well, yeah, we know. Yeah, we know that now. now. But we didn't know what yeah. the hell he was before. Like, <laughs> like when people play the game the first time, they're like, "Oh, it's a flower. He's a dick." And then you realize that he's an actual. Oh, so it is called your best. Fourteen left. Fourteen dickheads left. <laughs> nah, he'll be our best compost. <laughs> Dang. So does that mean when your best nightmare is playing, it's just an evil version of the F U N song from SpongeBob? Then. <sighs> if it's for friends, you burn down the. I'm like, okay, well, calm down, man. You're trying to be a metal. <laughs> Me a metal person. Yeah, fun. Friends. <laughs> he's not your best friend. He's just that his theme is called your best friend. <laughs> yeah, but you know, it's got to play as your best friend. Fourteen dicks. Bugga. Fourteen dicks. That's why I once said. Okay. Even though one of them is a girl, which is Muppet. <laughs> he is a BFF. He's a bestie. He's not our bestie. We don't even know him. <laughs> I know. He wasn't our bestie in the first place. He really wasn't. We were nobody's friends in this game. <laughs> I like to my He's 
the BFF, boldly foolish flower, Kappa. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> she could have a dick. <laughs> I mean, I don't know how spider anatomy is, but I, I, I just want to say no. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say no because I don't get it. <laughs> you shouldn't. Oh yeah, we I know that rock. The battle theme is called Enemy Approaching. <laughs> Even though they aren't really our enemy, they're just monsters. I don't like to call them enemies. I call them monsters. Because well, enemies and I... sounds harsh. <laughs> Sheena, we're in the genocide route. We have to be harsh. They're, uh, I know. they're, they're enemies that, now. We, we can call it Enemy Approaching. Yeah, or, they're, they're, they're enemies or now. Prey uh, Approaching. <laughs> They need to die, is what we're trying to say. <laughs> we can find out, just need to find the knives. But we're all out of knives. That's how far as made, they touch tips. I mean, I guess. <gasps> touch tips. <laughs> That's not good. Never touch tips, kids. Because <laughs> once you touch tips, you get fucked. Hopefully, Sand doesn't like, decapitate you. <laughs> Oh Dang. no, I'm pretty sure I'm probably gonna die like 70,000 times. <laughs> Y'all need Jesus? <laughs> oh, so you are approaching me. I forgot how that meme goes. <sighs> the approaching thing. Still I think that's Jojo, isn't it? I still hate it that both Trav and fucking Locke did that. That's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> they literally made me take that damn picture. I hate them for it. <laughs> Rock, same here. That is still my favorite song in the entire game. I love it. What are you talking about? Death by Glamour. He says it's his favorite song in the game. Me too. I like this song. I love it. <laughs> Just like Sly Cooper got decapitated. Like, what? I don't know anything about that. SGB reference. Ah. This when Elliot was playing through slide two, and then for some reason the game kind of crashed on him, and it kind of cut off Sly's head. Jesus is currently riding in the dumpster. Would you like to leave a message? And again, I also love how the Ocarina of Time during the Flare Dancer fight, um, their game crashed on that too. It was funny. <laughs> <laughs> then again, to be fair, Matt was playing the 1.0 version of the game, so yeah. <laughs> saying, oh, you're approaching me? Sounds like I can't dunk on you unless I get closer. <laughs> oh yeah, because you're just like all across the room and you teleport. Uh, Frisk is androgynous. They, they don't have a gender. So... That's why when you see most arts of Frisk, unless, you know, you're looking in other forms of fashion, uh, it's usually, it doesn't look like a girl, neither a guy. Mm-hmm. So it's either, it take does, your pick. Yeah, whatever how you... Yeah, non-binary, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Frisk is frisky. <laughs> yeah, it's just, I mean, if you want to portray the human as, or Frisk, any gender, then so be it, but they're non-binary. Best guess is very, uh, bleh. So that people are ridiculously sensitive these days, hence the crashes. My best guess is very worn cartridge slot on very dirty cartridges. I want to say it's probably that, but I still find it funny that it happened during the Fire Temple fight. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, it's like, what the hell happened? It's like, oh, okay. I just love how Donnie said, you shouldn't have used the Megaton Hammer. <laughs> it's like, and he never used the Megaton Hammer against that fight ever again. It's like, damn. Nothing happy happy at the Ash winning, woo! I'm glad that he finally won too. And now we can all oh. rejoice. Also love how Veronica Taylor actually um, tweeted that out too. I still find that creepy though that the the toys moving his mouth and his eye. I'm like, mm, I'm kind of creeped out by that. Leave the toys alone. Let her have fun with her toys. Look, I, look, my sister had the same exact toy, and just seeing the face move like that, I'm like, I got a little bit creeped out by that. I'm like, mm. what? You mean you don't <laughs> like Toy Story? <laughs> no, well, Toy Story's done better. That was just. 
Also, there was a Haha -ha Davis video that I watched where it was basically, um, you know how like oh, when you, story thing? no, no, okay, well, no, it wasn't that, it was a, it was another one where he's like, no, well, actually, no, he did make a joke like that where he says like, you know, like, you know, back in the day where you kind of like, um, you end up hearing your parents come into your room and you oh, end up yeah. falling like a toy star yeah, yeah, yeah. doll. One. Yeah, yeah I, I love that, and I also love the one where he was like, um, he was like playing video games, and his uh, dad kept coming in, and he, he ended up finding him again, <laughs> and he started screaming, <laughs> like he's about to get whooped or something. It's like, why do we scream when we're about to get punished? I don't get it. This doesn't do anything. It's just annoying. <laughs> On my pal Oot Run, I found back in time glitch in the early 2000s all items were kept but all progress was rest i had tcrf track it down and the chances of it going off is one to 34 million oh well, shit <laughs> oh yeah Mateo, the, the, the characters in this game refer for us to as they so yeah but i guess to a link between worlds cute I can't wait until they get to Link's Awakening again. I also can't wait to go oh, ahead yeah. and play Link's Awakening when that comes out on Friday. And yes, we probably will be streaming that on Friday, depending on how we- I'm sorry, Experiment, we'll get to Metroid soon! <laughs> Metroid win? Uh... Trying to pick a date. Day, not date. Jeez. I mean, that's the same thing. Experiment said he can wait. Cool! I like it when people can wait. Makes me feel better. Ash one was cool too. Counter, 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 counter. Mm? <laughs> Ash one, so now he's free. Yeah. That means we can finally get ourselves a new protagonist. I don't know what that new protagonist is gonna be, but hopefully it's actually a little bit better, and they can probably take the series into a different um, pers perspective this time, rather than how it is now. Like I don't mind how it is now, but it's like you know, be a could take if they actually kind of incorporate stuff from the manga a little bit. <laughs> uh, no, not Brandon. No, I'm not other M. Uh, Metrofine too. Also, apparently the black and white manga they had the gym leaders being crucified. I don't know what the hell that what? was. Yeah, there's a manga page of the thing. If you actually type in black and like I, I learned this from one of the BSC parts of Platinum, and if you type in um, black and white gym leader crucified they are actually in the page being crucified on crosses and i'm like hmm hey then hmm well then hmm i don't understand that <laughs> <laughs> all i know is next week shit gets real what happens next week well all i know is link's awakening i don't know like, any other stuff uh oh experiment what you have planned the black and white black and white two mangas arc are Seriously dark. Oh. It sounds dark. Really? Huh. That probably explains it. I only have like freaking three, four. But I only have. I don't even have the whole manga of that. I only have like half of the manga of that. <laughs> Link's Awakening is this week. Yeah, it is. Who's yeah. getting Link's Awakening? <laughs> also, I don't know. Also, I don't know how he won. All I know is that um, he won, and I'm I'm happy that he won. I'm happy that you know all that stuff happening. He he, he managed to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Link gets woke. <laughs> Can't wait for more Guilty Gear news in the next week. Oh. Oh, Rock, you're fine. <laughs> What's up? No, I just saying that you're not the social type. I mean, everyone has their um, introvert side. Like, I'm not that social when it comes to online sometimes. They say I, I tend to be shy and all that. I like just I tend, tend to not really. I kind of more so than the person that kind of initiate conversations half at a time whether you decide to be <laughs> to talk back to me is up to you yeah, six left. yeah six left we're going we're gonna keep okay going. okay because i don't think you're getting anything there nope <laughs> we're talking entire she's getting flash frozen alive and then we get to see it 
smash in their own fighting sword. That's that gar that's the big giant garbage thing. Oh, I guess I keep seeing like gifts or videos of that on Twitter. I think that kind of comes from the sky or something. Yeah, I think it's supposed to be one of the void interdimensional Pokemons. I forgot. It's been a while since I played Sun and Moon. Then again, I don't even think that's a Pokemon that's in from Sun and Moon. I think it's from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. I think. I don't know. Don't quote me on that. <laughs> Yeah! Oh, uh, Rox, it really depends on the person. Like, it, sometimes it is kind of hard to strike up a conversation, especially if it's somebody random that you don't know. But if it's somebody that you do know, most of the time you can't come up with a conversation. Well, you know, just simply like a hello, how's your day going kind of deal. Usually a good starter. <laughs> the entire Pokemon manga is, is fucked, honestly. Well, I know the mangas are actually a lot more darker. Because I remember like the first... Like when it first came out as a manga, I have heard about some dark stuff from it. Yeah, like my favorite one is when Giovanni decapitates the friggin' Ekans when he freezes it with um, oh dear. his ice Pokemon. Oh dear. Yeah, you actually see it too. It's uh, quite a thing. God. Mm-hmm. Who are the Ultra Beasts from the universe that was destroyed by some sort of nuclear fallout or other energy-related disaster? So wait, how many have a lot right now? Four. Four? Okay, so they count too. Oh yeah, sorry. Oh yeah, yeah, we can go. Yeah, because yeah, Muffet and then I think the last three in the core. Again, Muff I forgot about Muffet. Muffet, we're coming for you. <laughs> Muffet, I'm home. Pokemon die in the manga. I mean, and, yeah, and apparently one died in Pokemon U2. And I also love how freaking um, Lance is basically the villain in the manga adventure. That's actually kind of cool. Even though all of them are kind of dicks. Especially Agatha, where she just literally hates um, uh, Red because of the fact that she's jealous of Professor Oak for being what he is. And I'm like, man, you jealous. <laughs> it's like, she just... get impaled by Alex Sam like his fucking Dragon Ball Z. Sheesh. I know, right? The manga's cool. Also, you end up seeing literally Eevee being the biological Pokemon that it's supposed to be, be combined by, um, get the combination of all the evolutions all at, at once. And yet, we've still not seen the end of Black and White 2. <laughs> People die when they are killed. <laughs> You're not wrong, Matea. Roy guards, Muppet, Force, Core Encounters, you'll be fine. Okay, so yeah, okay. I was thinking, like, wait, are we cool? Like, I keep forgetting about Muffet. So, yeah, you're good to go to the core. Because you have the Force Encounters in the core. Well, at least these spiders say the same thing. Apparently, they were not watching what the hell I did. Shame. Yeah, you do skip, um, the Metaton segments in this part, because they just... Because <laughs> he knows you're, you know, you're doing bad things. He's like, I'm not doing TV shows with you. I'll lose viewership. <laughs> Fuck this. <laughs> you post a cringe. <laughs> I'm gonna lose subscriber. I mean, I mean, that's pretty much what goes through his mind. <laughs> well, the yellow arc, at least. Oh. Love it. Yep. And I find this kind of sad. The spider's just like, no, our leader. Leo Lance is a douchebag. <laughs> Yeah, Muppet dies so fast. He put a flower for her. Oh, well, funny enough, I already know the characters that actually die quickly. The only one, <laughs> spoiler, undies the only one who doesn't actually die fast. Everyone else does. <laughs> I do know of that one as well. <laughs> Looks that spider. Run! <laughs> Time for a big sad. Aww. <laughs> and then he stomps on the spider. I mean... <laughs> They kind of disappear, so all you're doing is just stomping on their dust. Alright, I think now we can probably get rid of all these. Because just... is this oh, yeah. is this the shop with the good shit? Uh, well, no, it's not the same stuff. Actually, you don't want to drop it because you might want to sell them and go back to Tommy Village. So that way you can get the good items that's in the burger shop. So wait, I have to still buy those? E yeah. Why is he still there? He's still there. Why? He's there. He's the Burger only one still there. What the fuck? Are you shitting me? Yep. Why? I don't know. 
Why is he not being... afraid? Ugh. And plus, you know, Metaton will yell at him if he leaves, because apparently he still has to work. I'm killing everyone in existence, and your ass is still here, and I still gotta pay for shit. Man, kiss my ass. Yep, junk the old equips because Burger Pants is the real MVP. <laughs> he don't give a fuck. <laughs> he doesn't care. Hey, is that Leah, right? Yeah, Leah. Okay, I, I keep had to memorize the username. What's up, Leah? She said it's me. It's your boy. Oh, is it? <laughs> no, <I'm laughs> it's Leah. <laughs> okay, I was gonna say. <laughs> Gross. See the spider leaves a flower where mother died. Wow, I feel like a jerk now. Oh, time to continue my con my killing spree. Hey, Leah, how's it going? How's it going? <laughs> he ran out of vacation days. Oh, that's what happened to Burger Pants. He ran out of vacation days. All right, that still pops up. She says hello. We doing pretty Gucci. We heard you Gucci too. Yeah. <laughs> where we were like, he's not afraid of the dead. Mm. I well, mean, that I mean, explains a lot. Then again, he is kind of one of those people that kind of can't really... I mean, then again, the Tammy's is still here, so it doesn't matter. Tam not afraid of death. Tam is also stupid and needs to leave. <laughs> he, he still has a death day. How come we can't stab him? I don't know. Why can't we get, go across the town and just kill them? So can I sell all of these? Elias, uh, yeah, whenever you don't need. You can just sell... But nobody came. <laughs> she said she'd want to stop by and say what's up to you guys and to support. Cool. Thank you. Thanks for the supporters. <laughs> Burger Pants is better than me. I just fail. Honestly, same. I would fail. I'd be like, nope. <laughs> I'm not ready to die. Tam is death. <laughs> Burger Boy is a college student working on the, the, the dark shift. He can kill his family and he won't give a backsided fuck. Well, dang. So whatever you don't need, you just kind of sell it. I see the quiche. Try to sell the quiche? Uh, I mean, I forgot how much that sells. Mm. I mean, you can look at you can look up the item like how much it heals. Cause I don't remember how much the. Uh, it's supposed to keep the quiche. Keep the quiche. Keep the quiche. Can I sell everything else? Uh. Tough glove. Yeah, the other weapons, you don't really need them. <laughs> Tem, bringer of death. Oh, jeez. Go for the menu, you can sell things for more. <laughs> Tammy's gonna die, and that makes me sad. Don't kill Tammy, Tem is a good girl. Or dude. Whatever gender they are. Tem is Tem, that's their gender. Their gender is Tem. <laughs> that's what I'm gonna go with, and that's all I'm gonna say. It might be good to get the artifact to grind dog stuff. That is true. The artifact is still there, I think. I don't know if you got the artifact. No. But, oh, well, I mean, I think you have enough money to buy whatever you need. So, I think you're kind of good. Look, I'm trying to drag this out because we already know that we're going to be spending like two hours in Sans fight. Or even more, depending yeah. on how long it takes us. I mean, look at yeah. what happened. Look what happened when we got to Undying. We got past everybody and we fought Undying and we took like a good three hours just to get past her. Experiments and everything else, sell them. Why are we keeping the quiche? I think the quiche is kind of good. I don't know how much it heals. You can look up the info of the, of the quiche. Tem don't die. Tem only gets stronger. Everyone is dead, but we still buy college for Tem. Go get the artifact? Alright. I mean, yeah. I mean, if you want, if you need to. To grind for some more money. Speaking of Tam, I have oh, a plush whoops. of Tam. Did you go to the wrong area? Yeah, I went to Snowden. Okay, I'm gonna put my <laughs> glasses away since I'm not really fighting anything. Well, not yet, but yeah. Hmm. Are they saying hmm hmm? Huh? I don't know. The river person was saying hmm. Oh, he's probably questioning my logic as to why I keep killing people. Why is it so quiet? <laughs> more money, more healing items. That Wait. is true. 
Um, where's the place with the dog thing? Isn't it like over in it's this? In it's in a waterfall. <sighs> I'm gonna just go through here. It's it's in waterfall. I'm gonna it's waste. Like for, it's further down waterfall. I'm gonna waste time. No oh, then. <laughs> The log guy. I really why the music is so creepy during the genocide row. Doing the genocide row is like watching a horror movie, but from the perspective of the monster. <laughs> yeah, actually, when you think about if you think about think of it that way, then yeah. So after all the encounters in Hotlands and Sands, uh, basically, yeah. After all the encounters in Hotland, it's pretty much Sands is next. <laughs> it's you, Sands, 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 and Sands. Yeah, it's in the raining area. Um, yeah, that's like a long ways. <laughs> Good. Oh, so we never kill the rip person? Yeah, we never kill the rip person, because if we kill them, then how are we going to transport to the other areas then? Beware <laughs> the man who talks with hands. But we don't see him, yeah. <laughs> but we will soon. Uh, actually, no, we won't. Well, no, I don't even know. no, we won't I see. we won't see the river man that talks with hands. River man? Did you call him the river man? Yeah, the river man. You know, the river man that lives on Jury Lane. Uh, uh, right. Oh, yeah, you do have to go the other way. That's what I thought. I'm like, that's a long way to go. Oh, yeah, it really doesn't exist anymore. I nope. guess I guess he killed the frog, too. Well, no, they just evacuated. Remember that. Well, this was a waste of my damn time. Anyways, let's go back to Waterfall. Is that Sans Smash Brothers? Oh yeah, you can say that now, but people are gonna call him Sans Smash Brothers. <laughs> Yo, is that the Smash character from the Smash <laughs> Brothers? Forgot Giovanni in the Pokemon Go has his Beejo hold, uh, hold, wait, hold, oh, hold red at night point, jeez. Yeah, Giovanni actually was pretty, um... Threatening. Pretty, yeah, pretty metal. Even though he kind of worked with um Red at one point. Huh, weird. I can't. I think because there was probably I think a bigger threat. Well, actually, no. Uh, never mind. I take that back. No, you didn't. Never mind. Survivors are probably hiding in the true lab. I mean, probably. Yeah, that's what. Yeah, that's what I said. Was the one to evacuate them, and they they're in the cavern, so they really had nowhere to go. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like they're probably in the true lab. They went missing for mistakes and all that. Hey, there's one way to get her secret out. <laughs> Alright, guys, so <laughs> these are the amalgamations. Don't freak uh, out. Uh, I, um, they they won't uh, hurt you as long as they eat, and if you uh, and if they get hungry, then well, well we're screwed. I know some, uh, some for some of you, these are your family members that turn into this, so yeah. Uh, don't think too hard on it. They're, they're still alive, though, technically. They're just, you know, taking on a different form. Also, when I bought the 10 plush from Fangamer, I paid a bit more for an optional um, Tim college, and I got a small graduation cap and a degree for Tim. Oh, that's cute! I actually really hope that I can get my hoodie from that one store that I bought from because they made a mistake <laughs> and got me the wrong hoodie because well, the hoodie that I got you, was. At least you don't have to pay for it again. Yeah, uh, I know, but the hoodie I like... got. Oh, I'm dumb. Yeah, Sorry. I... Yeah. <laughs> Listening to this music gives me such an eerie vibe. I mean, I know that's the point, but damn, it's effective. It really wait, is. Wait, is it this way or this way? Yeah, yeah, go, yeah, keep going. This way? Wait, can you not go back to it? I don't think you could go back to it. Yeah, I don't think I can. Yeah, because the, 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 the thing is broken. And the duck is gone. Oh, yeah, the duck is gone. Yeah, I was going to say, it's... Huh, okay, I guess we can't do the artifact thing then. Jubai was an actual mob boss. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, if we get a dead game, you know what that means. <laughs> Why didn't no one taught a Pokemon how to use a gun? <laughs> Cause that'd be it. You can walk through Waterfall from Snowden to get to the raining area. Uh, can ya? Cause we tried to do that, and we couldn't go across the marsh. Because the thing was gone. Walk through waterfall from Snowden to get to the Renier? But sure. I remember where Ash was held at gunpoint. I don't remember. I, I don't remember that during the um arc with the Squirtles. The 
frog is and how you get back there. Well, the frog's not there, that's the thing. So, hmm. It's the regular path. Yeah, the frog, because the frog's not there in the genocide. So I need to buy Persona 5, Sea Legion, Academy Varsity Jacket, yes. Those are a thing. Uh, I don't know, I don't really see anything. I'm slightly confused. I remember the frog being another shortcut. Yeah, I remember the frog, but I think that's... I don't think they were in the genocide pack, because they're supposed to be there, but I guess they're not. So wait, where am I going? I don't know. Well, nothing lost, I guess. Uh, I don't know, I, I guess... So what, we're going back? back. I, I guess the heartland. Hopefully, you try to go from Snowden, and the path is kind of, you know, gone. <laughs> well, yeah. And if we try to go, if we try to go to the waterfall shortcut with the river person, all you're gonna go to is the Undyne area. So yeah. Oh, well, rip. oh well. It would have just been an easier way to grind healing items. True. Yeah, oh well. Yeah, honestly, Mateo, I think we should be fine, because I didn't have to do that when I did genocide, so I think we're all good. All I gotta remember is to dodge half of his damn attacks, and I should be fine, famous last words. <laughs> well, that was a waste. <laughs> nah, it's cool. As you know, the whole white hoodie that Anne wears under this her school uniform in the game, yeah, you can buy that hoodie. Oh, nice. Or on. I think that's how I pronounce her name in Persona. But otherwise, you can't get stuff from Burger Lad. Nice. I mean, I think we got plenty of money. How much money do you have? Three. Three thousand. I I think you're good. I think you're good. You just gotta make space for you know good items and all that. Why are you still here? Evacuation. <laughs> you're yanking my chain, little weirdo. So, what if everybody else left work? So what if nobody's buying anything? Ah, for the cause, little weirdo. Ah, for the cause. <laughs> well. Metaton didn't tell me I had to work, I guess. But that's the thing. Sometimes he doesn't even call me into work until halfway into my shift. If I don't play it safe, he's gonna yell at me. Okay, maybe yell is the wrong term. It's more like he has this CD album he plays. It's entirely full of songs about how bad I am at my job. Jeez. Huh? Everyone else is dead? Does that mean I don't have to work today? God, that, that is were true, little weirdo. That it were true. <laughs> Sorry, little weirdo. Threats won't work on me. I can't go to hell. I'm all out of vacation days. Oh, well. right, oh well, that was actually true. He's out of vacation days. I thought that you guys were joking about that. All right, what the hell am uh, I buying? Get the the, the shape of Metaton's base stick thing. Cause that's actually really, really uh, good. Okay. It was only a one-time buy, though, fortunately. Okay. But it heals a lot. So, legendary heroes really good. So am I buying just nothing but legendary heroes? Yeah, probably. Yeah, those, those are really good. Yeah, yeah, legendary hero, the hero is good. How many so should you I get? Money for that. You should be fine. Should I buy one more? You should pretty much buy all of it at this point. But well, you you have the pie too. Uh, do I? I. Hope you do. Is that the quiche? I had the abandoned quiche. It's not really it. How much does that heal? Check the info. Heals 34. Oh, that's not a lot. Hmm. Then why do we need to be keep the quiche? Mm hmm. <laughs> Experiment, you lied to us. I mean, <laughs> experiments that keep the quiche. I keep the quiche. Why do we need to keep the quiche? <laughs> Yeah, at least say you got enough, but, you know, it doesn't hurt to be, you know, prepared. Because you never know. I'm trying not to die here. I mean, I'm going to die I mean, anyways, you, but I still. mean, you could always go back, so. Okay, so I can still go back. Yeah, you can still technically go back. Not like that like, matters, after, anyways. After the hotland area, yeah. No, oh, experiment thought it was a full heal. Well, <laughs> you don't need that anymore. Oh, shit. Did I miss the noodles? Wait, the noodles? The noodles. The noodles in Alfie's lab? Wait, are the noodles in Alfie's lab? I think they are. I think they're in her 
refrigerator. I need or... those. That thing heals you for full. Wait, during the fight? It, it's, it, the instant noodles heal a lot. For me, it doesn't. Oh. It's always, always like heal like four HP. No, you're wrong because I had it during the fight. It fully heals you? I, I don't know. We're gonna go get the it's noodles. Like, it's like, it's on the other path. I mean, I'm gonna do whatever, but I, I don't. I, does it? I don't know. I don't know the I'm secrets just, of the noodles. I'm gonna get the noodles. I don't know the secrets of I'm the noodles. I'm gonna get the dang noodles. <laughs> dang noodles. <laughs> I'm gonna get the noodles. Play as much as make as it makes you comfortable for you. Yeah. I think three anymore. Nope, it's only one. <laughs> Roxy, just get the noodles. Yeah, it says heals HP. Comes with everything you need for a quick meal. Instant noodles. Huh, for the other path, it only heal like only a little bit. Maybe because that's a that's a pacifist route and the genocide route for some so. reason they actually do shit. <laughs> I didn't know that. I guess so, huh? That's interesting. They double as a gag item and the ultimate heal. Oh, yeah. that I did not know. Yeah, I kind of oh, figured because most gag. Yeah, because most gag items usually do better stuff. Huh. That's why the knife and the locket changed to something different. I well, did not know that about the noodles. Huh. Well, now you know, because you saw me. Oh, I thought you saw okay. me use instant noodles before, and it healed no, you to full. No, I was kind of playing the game. That's fine. I mean, you don't I have to pay really attention to me. Half the time. Yeah, like, that, I saw that's... the noodles. I'm like, why is the noodles there? I was questioning, like, why is the noodles there? That's cool. <laughs> Those are bad. I that was a bad item to have. Well, now you re now you realize that they're not bad items. I'll be sure to get Well, I mean, noodles are good for the soul, I guess. Um, I recommend going to. Like, yeah, I know. <laughs> I was like, huh? Like, oh, go in the door yet? Because is that not the last um, corridor area? But it's like when you try and find that switch to get rid of the lasers, whatever. Is it the I think that's where you can find the last three um, enemies. Still want to try actual ramen one day, but there are no ramen places near me. Grumbles, stupid Houston, Texas. Oh, well, I mean, I'm pretty sure if you find like a Japanese restaurant, maybe they might have ramen. So, yeah. Just gotta find a good Japanese restaurant and hopefully they do authentic ramen. Tina's forcing me to eat authentic ramen. She won't shut up about it. It is better than actually than, than box ramen. I like box ramen. I mean, I eat box ramen too, but authentic ramen is good as well. Yeah, this room right here. They should have three. The official value set, I believe, is one, two, three, four, ninety-nine. Oh, for the noodles? Huh. Also, we have 46 days till Luigi's Mansion 3! Yeah! I can't wait for that game. The passive area really gives you full, but on Genocide, the way your character works almost always runs you 99 HP. Huh. Authentic rat ramen is, is, is divine. You said authentic rat. <laughs> it's like, what? Authentic ramen is oh, divine. Man. I love authentic rat. <laughs> All these packages, the noodle. I mean, I have packaged ramen too. Because, you know, there's not really a lot of places that have authentic ramen. Like, you really gotta find, like, a good Japanese restaurant that has, like, good authentic ramen. Like, we used to over here, but a stupid restaurant took over. And it, we tried that restaurant and it's, ugh, no. It's, they don't have much. <laughs> they don't have much in the menu. So I have in here a couple of chip should be in a few box standard restaurant, but anything else you gotta import it or make it yourself. Oh, there's a plenty of them here. There's like three of them. Okay, so you could have got here with like more than five because I think Does the enemies in the encounter No, I don't think the enemies no, in the field. No no no. Well yeah, three of them, but we had three more left at the time, so uh huh, I mean better be safe sorry, so level is still only 14. Wait, is it? What's that? Oh yeah, it is 14. What, is that bad? Wait, is this supposed to be 19? Oh, we're fucked. Unless... Oh, now you're 15. Oh, we're gonna die. Hmm. Eh, you'll be fine. <laughs> Wait, what's the last four of its been? No, 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 I forgot, experiment meds. Experiment meds on to see, like, four levels off. Oh, okay. So, I recommend a... I heard them talk about on Super Beard Brothers. I don't know. 
him. Yeah, I forgot he gives a lot of experience. And I'm the saw just stopped. Counters. Nope, they're all in the same area. <laughs> Mission complete. All right. Termination. My, my. So you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, you can't be a star without an audience. And besides, there are some people I want to protect. <laughs> Eager as always, eh? But don't touch that dial. It's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more photogenic body. However, those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer and I'll be forced to show you my true form. Fine then. Ready? It's showtime! It's showtime indeed. Say hello to Metaton Neo. Yeah, that's what I figured. Yeah. He's actually weaker in that form. Mm-hmm. Guess you don't want to join my fan club. Funny enough, he does say something different when you do kill him. I think if you actually spared, or not spared, if you didn't kill all the enemies in Hotland or whatever, I think you can still face Metaton Neo if you don't kill all the monsters, because he will say something, say something different, which is actually really interesting what he says to you. Oh, that's great. Uh, it's time. <laughs> I That actually really, really makes me sad and disappointed. Like, I actually wanted him to be challenging, but because he his the design looks really cool, and I kind of hope that he does some really cool stuff. But Such a wasteful that's design, true. too, because, like, it yeah, really that's, is. Like, and that's it. It's like, well. And there is a really cool fan fight of him, and ah, I, I wish he did more. <laughs> I really wish he did, because that honestly really disappoints me. All right, ladies and gents, the moment that everybody, for some forgodsaken reason, was waiting for. I don't know what's wrong with you guys. Uh, <laughs> like. At any rate, it's time for the moment y'all been waiting for. <laughs> it's about to get down. It's time to fight Smash Brothers. <laughs> the walk to the fucking <laughs> Walden. That's pretty in much what it's corner, like. In this corner, we got a level 19 human. In this corner, we got a skeleton with 1 HP, but is mega super powerful. And dickish. Yeah. This is also a very dumb trollish moment. I hate this. Oh, that's why you kept... Well, I mean, you can just drop it. What? The... Shoot, what is it? The items you don't need. You don't need cloudy glasses, I don't think. Or the abandoned quiche. Well, no, I mean, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna keep the abandoned quiche. That thing is gonna be the real hero of this game. <laughs> <laughs> this is stupid because those two weapons end up giving you tremendous power, but it means jack and shit in the grand scheme of things because Sans is immortal up until Gosh, like the end. One last time. Howdy, Kara. You yep, finally so made it home. Monsters. Remember, when we used to play here, that's how I miss one enemy. Here Boy. we go. The meat gunner, the meat Today's gunner. gonna be just as fun. <laughs> In this corner, the meat gunner, the meat hunter. Sans the skeleton. Tiny fight meat gunner. This is the moment, this is the time, this is the genesis of whatever your name is. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, real nice. <laughs> Kara. I remember when I first woke up here in the garden. I was so scared. I couldn't feel my arms or my legs. My entire body had turned into a flower. Mom, Dad, somebody help me, I called out. But nobody came. Oh, Flowey. You... It's a me, <laughs> Kara. <laughs> Eventually, the king found me, crying in the garden. Yeah. I explained I that. Like yeah, gr 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 the greeting garage. Gr the garage. The I explained that it happened to him. Then he held me, Kara. He held me with tears in his eyes, saying, 
There, there. Everything is gonna be alright. He was so emotional. But for some reason, I didn't feel anything at all. So <laughs> Sounds like my life. Traffic, the way you make it is take some chicken nuggets, mush them up with your hand, bake it, then take some chicken nuggets and repeat the process until you made a tortilla with the nuggets. Um, I don't know what to do after that. <laughs> Well, I mean, it does sound yummy. Chicken nuggets always sound yummy. I thought you were giving me a secret on how to actually beat Sans, but all right. <laughs> with chicken nuggets. Yeah, with chicken nuggets. <laughs> Just throw chicken nuggets and he'll take it, right? I didn't feel anything. My compassion had disappeared. And believe me, it's not like I was trying. I wasted weeks with that stupid king, vainly hoping I would feel something. But it became too much for me. I ran away from home. Eventually, I reached the ruins. Inside, I found her. Kara. I thought of all people, she could make me feel whole again. Funny enough, Kara's, they kind of, you know, say that she. She failed. Well then. Please, call me Sans Smash Brothers. Sans Undertale was my father. I realized those two were useless. I became disappointed. I just wanted to love someone. I just wanted to care about someone. Kara, you might not believe this, but I decided it wasn't worth living anymore. Not in the world without love. Not in the world without you. So, I decided to follow in your footsteps. I erased myself from existence. And you know what? I succeeded. I like, well, whereas we story of Kira and Azra in the past, and she gets the story of what happens afterward from Flowey. Mm -hmm. But as I left this mortal coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you... Something primal started to burn inside me. No. I thought, I don't want to die. Then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back in the garden. Back at my save point. There you go. <laughs> it's as if the players expected to call the true password switch on the side. Yep. That's Interesting. Much I how decided to experiment. Again and again, I brought myself to the edge of death. At any point, I could have let this world continue on without me. But as long as I was determined to live, I could go back. Amazing, isn't it? I was amazed, too. Guess. So Flowey is a nobody. <laughs> At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved all their problems flawlessly. Their companionship was amusing for a while. As times repeat, repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave them this? What would they do if I said this to them? Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. All right, well, giving us the plot synopsis of the <laughs> game. If Azrael was a nobody, his nobody name would be Raxasel. It all started because I was curious. Curious what would happen if I killed them. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to know what happened. Everyone's just thoughts in the genocide round in a nutshell. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. At least we're better than those sickos that stand around and watch it happen. Those pathetic people that want to see it, but are too weak to do it themselves. Oh shit, Flowey's calling them out. I bet someone like that's watching right now. Fuck! Dang. He's calling you guys out. <laughs> Get into darkness, Kara. Nowadays, even that's grown tiring. You understand, Kara? I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book. I've burned every book. I've won every game. I've lost every game. I was like a Twitch streamer in a nutshell. Uh, I mean, what? I appeased everyone, I've killed everyone. S sets of numbers, line of dialogue, I've seen them all. But you, you're different. I never could predict you. And that's the problem, and that's why you fucking die in the end of the game, because you're fucking <laughs> dumb. Honey, I've been there, I've done it, got the Coast Guard and everything. <laughs> oh yeah, I love sunshine. <laughs> when I saw you in the ruins, I didn't recognize you. I thought I could frighten you, then steal your soul. I failed. And when I tried to load my save file, it didn't work. Kara, your determination. Somehow it's even greater than mine. Listen, bitch, I got weak killer in the shed. <laughs> I just have one question for you, Kara. How did you get back to the ruins from here? Wait, I know. She must have taken you when she left. Oh, wait, you're talking about Toriel. Never mind. <laughs> Scratch that. I decided to give you a proper burial rather than hanging out in the basement forever. But why then? What made you wake up? Did you hear me calling you? <laughs> That's funny. Call. Wink. <laughs> it doesn't matter now. I'm so tired of this, Kara. I'm tired of all of these people. I'm tired of all this, these places. I'm tired of being a flower. Kara, there's just one thing left I want to do. 
let's finish what we started. Let's free everyone. Then, let's let them see what humanity is really like. That despite it all, this world is still kill or be killed. I have watched all animes, Kara. Then, well, I had been entertaining a few ways to use that power. But seeing you here changed my mind. Kara, I think you're around. If you're around, just living in a surface world doesn't seem so bad. God, you're so dumb. <laughs> Apparently, if more than one person has a high level of determination, the time stream takes priority over whoever is strongest. <laughs> the king has six of them lock away. I've tried hundreds of ways to get him to show them to me, show them to me, but he just won't. Kara, I know he'll do it for you. Dude, I've been like killing people left and right. I don't really think I think he will just murder me at this point. Am I telling you all this? <laughs> Kara, I said before, even after all this time, you're still the only one that understands me. You're dumb. Sorry, Sunshine, but they're calling me one. Ugh. All right, Flower, you kind of annoy me now. <laughs> Get to the point. Uh oh, shaking. Why am I shaking? Hey, Kara, how are our feelings about back then, right? Hey, what are you doing? Back off! <laughs> Shut up and kill each other already. Wait, did I say that out loud? What's in the mind about all this? This isn't a good idea anymore. You should go back, Kara. Oh, now you're rethinking shit, huh? This was just fun the way it is. Stop making that creepy face. This isn't funny. You've got a sick sense of humor. Why are you suddenly fearing fear now, Flowey? I know. Ah, fuck. Yep, here we go. We here, ladies and gents. We're at the moment that we all been waiting for. It's time for me to die. <laughs> time to use my lighter. <laughs> Might as well get a snowman piece or I know butterscotch pie. Cause I thought that fully heals you. We got it, guys. The ultimate inventory. And the legendary hero. Wait, we got a snowman piece. We we can't die now. No, actually, we probably still can't die. Yeah, I'll just say put the legendary hero. That heals 45. No, they're both good. We're, we're fine. There, nothing in this inventory actually can save me. Well, I mean, it's fair. We have, like, I. Yeah, because the legendary hero is actually pretty good. Yeah. Alright, well. <sighs> Here we go. Time for hyperfuck. <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I had hey, to. you've been busy, huh? So, I've got a question for you. Do you think even the worst person can change? That everybody can be a good person if they just try? Nick versus Nick Kappa? I mean, he All has right. pretty much the answer. Well, here's a better question. Do you want to have a bad time? Because if there you take is. another step forward, you are really not going to like what happens next. Yes, yeah, Sans, you've been busy, too busy in Smash. Well, sorry, old lady. This is why I never make promises. Match of the century. It's a beautiful day outside. Birds are singing. Flowers are blooming. On days like this, kids like you... ...should be burning in hell. Fuck! Yeah. Not paying attention! My controller! Hey, we're good. At least we survived that. <laughs> huh? I always wonder why people never actually hold the controller stick when they're actually getting blasted on. Fuck, we're off to a great damn start. <laughs> yep. That's a good start. Oh, this is actually pretty uh, different compared to me using my PlayStation controller. So you know what? We're gonna actually we're, we're gonna actually die here because uh, we we fucked up. The sand. Uh. Shit, this D-pad sucks! Are you using the GameCube? I'm using the GameCube! And it fucking I was, sucks! I have the GameCube too. And it fucking blows! Man, yeah, at least you died in the first try! Yeah, what the fuck do? Yeah, that's a good point. I actually did die in the first part of that. Well, I am not surprised. <laughs> Meme fight! Also, he ends up literally, like, counting, like, how many times you like die after oh, a while this 
at, okay, after a while, this line actually does stop. Yeah, yeah, after a while, I get kind of tired of saying the same thing. Oh. Why are lies? Take a load off. Oh, you fuck off. <laughs> There's no point in trying to get a perfect hit on that. Cause he's just gonna avoid you. Yeah, this is weird trying to actually play this off of this. Look, damn if I controller. can do it on the GameCube, so can you. <sighs> and it felt look, it felt weird to use off the GameCube as well, but yeah, I know you can do it. Uh, fine, whatever. I'm glad that you actually believe in me. That's fine. I know you can do it. He stops counting after twelve. Oh, okay, that's what I felt like. I think it was like twelve deaths. He just stops counting. Since this is what's called karmic retribution, which is essentially poison, he does it one HP per frame and ignores all defenses. Okay, so you can do it. Also, it's so weird to hear the original because the Smash version just sounds hella good. Ugh. You can take most attack sequences with a full health bar. True, but it's kind of better to try not to get hit by the attacks, because they hurt. Ah, oh, Sam, he's one of the few characters aware of the fact that this is just a video game. Ah, oh, true. Yeah, like, I'm, I'm, I'm with Sam, like, uh, I, like, it's, regardless, it's just a game. But yeah. It's not a game, it's real life, bro. <laughs> this isn't Dink and Rumpa. It's real life, brother. There's also the midpoint to heal since healing does not count towards progress in this fight. Mm-hmm. Wait, what's up? No, the halfway point. I guess, you know, that's a good time to heal during that part. Oh, yeah, when he's talking to me, he wants to spare me, and he says to get dunk on? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I know. Mm-hmm. This is completely different than using the damn, um, what you call a controller, by the way. Ugh. At least you're kind of familiar how his attacks work, for the most part. <laughs> Sans is my favorite dang and ripper character. I know, right? Uh, what would Sans ultimate talent be? Uh, <laughs> immortality. <laughs> ultimate immortal. Well, ultimate dodger, I should more so say. Ultimate meat gunner, I don't know. I thought you said meme gunner. <laughs> A meme, a meme gummy you might as well be called a meme gunner. <laughs> Should get to the dead point to burn that par for heart heals. Mm -hmm. If you need healing, yeah. Oop. Sounds just a god. Okay, don't fuck with me, man. Don't do that. You can heal it. Not eat through your items, I'm assuming. Yep. Damn it. Ugh. Black. I'm assuming that you're pretty good with that part that you decide not to heal because I saw your health bar. I'm like, ooh. ooh. Oh no, like, that's a, no, that's the thing. Like, you know, I can dodge a few of his attacks, whether or not it's like when does my energy deplete to a point that it becomes. Slightly oh, yeah. jaded. Yeah, yeah, because if I keep looking at this screen for too long, my vision will start to get blurry. Yeah, I, heard that. I can't look at the same. I can't look uh, at the uh, same this is screen. Only try number three, so we're not that far into it. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> what? You're not in the middle. You're you're, got, you're like towards the bottom. <laughs> Here's the thing about Sam, technically he goes down in one hit, the problem is that he's extremely hard to hit. God mm -hmm. damn it, thank you, D-pad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he got pretty far the second try. Yeah, he got pretty far. I'm really, I'm debating. I don't want to switch the controller though, because I know that the damn, you know what, you want to know what's going to happen? My fucking, sure. no, it's going to fucking drift and <laughs> just screw with me. Yeah, and I don't want you dealing with that in this fight. Might as well kind of deal with one control and try to get used to it. You Perfect. almost dodged the entirety of that. Sans entire boss fight is literally fuck you and your video game bullshit. Uh, yeah, Mate, he has actually um tried the Sans fight on the PC version. So he's kind of the 
familiar a bit how Sam's fights. I mean, yeah, he actually did it earlier. Yeah. Because he told me that he downloaded the PC version. I'm like, why'd you download the PC version and get the Switch version? And I didn't know what of his reasons for it. He, <laughs> yeah. he, said, he said he just wanted to play the game again. I'm like, oh, okay. But the other people just practice on the Sans fight. And I'm like, oh. I ain't stupid. <laughs> I know this. I, I thought you wanted to try to do the, the Gaster secret. <laughs> Gaster That's can... what I thought you wanted to do. Listen, Gaster can fucking wait, right? <laughs> I think when Experiment kind of mentioned that the whole you can like do certain things with the PC version, I was like, huh, maybe I should just do that with the practicing. I hate this fucking thing, by the way. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. It's not your fault. I it's know. the It's the GameCube's D-pad being ass, but then again, it's... Slight. I mean, I had to deal with it, and I managed through. Ow. I know. <laughs> Ooh, you almost fell into the pit. Um, and, I mean, kind of, was it? it was more so like a code yet to input in a PC version to um, kind of get a file. Actually, I think, like, Experiment would probably be able to explain it. Uh, yeah, probably, I guess. Because in all honesty, like, it, it is kind of something that you have to go into the game file and change, like, the numbers to that corresponding number. The coding number. thing. Yeah. yeah. It's like a coding thing. What? <laughs> that time simulator, I think it's called. No, 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 not the ga no, not the gaster um, experiment. The the thing that yeah. you can manipulate the save file. And you can like have a, like a save point where like before you fight Sans or something like that. Oh wait, I think experiment probably put it on there. I think he said like I think that's the link right there. Oh, well, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, he said if you want to go with go through the route on your own, peace, rich, and enjoy. Mm-hmm. Just in case, so you don't have to do the whole entire route. You can just literally just get to this fight, and that's basically what I was doing. Use every entire pattern, and even run the entire boss battle with different bits you can practice with. Mm -hmm. Did I just? <gasps> Bitch! Ooh! Good job! Woo! There we go. It's the get leak experiment supposed to. Mm -hmm. Fun value shit is crazy. I heard it, though. There's a bunch of crazy stuff you can do with the fun value. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Lisa was like, hot oh, damn, that was good. Yeah. Well, since Megalovania is... How you guys like the Smash version of Megalovania? Because that's really good to hear. Experiment clip of that. I wasn't even paying attention. I wasn't paying attention at the time. I'm not gonna lie to you. Because I was like, wait, what's happening? Clip that part where you dodged the first few attacks with the Gaster Blasters. I was surprised that he freaking dodged because I wasn't paying attention. I'm impressed. Because usually I always get hit by it. I agree, Lisa. Like the Smash version of Megalovania is so good. I love it. I like how they, you know, like they put like a little snippet of Toriel slash Asgore. Oh shit! My reaction exactly. <laughs> but yeah, no, I like the snippet that they added Bone Trasso and. Asgore's theme and at yeah. the end of Megalovania. It's really good. I love it. No one dying, though. <laughs> <GSN was shit. laughs> ah! Oh, well. Oh, there goes that Ultra Instinct, guys. It wasn't the run. <laughs> uh, you, you, you got your victory for a bit. Yeah, and now he's gonna take it away from me like a petty bitch. In fact, that's what we added in Heartache and Bunch of which is oof. Yeah, like, it's, I love that, like, like, I didn't get it at first, but when I heard it, because I saw, like, a Twitter post saying, oh, yeah, you hear, like, Bone Trousseau and Heartache in it, it's, it's really good, I'm like, man, I love it, it makes my skin crawl, I'm like, I really want to hear more remixes of Undertale being put into Smash Bros, I would love that. For me personally, I want to play Glamour. <laughs> I will love a remix of that in, the, in Smash. It'll be amazing. I'm gonna keep 
talking because I don't know if this song. No, will no, get... yeah, do that, please, because yeah, it actually I'll, will I'll... end up getting. Okay, we're at the halfway point. Okay, good. Plague. Stay well. Yeah, you might want to heal. I mean, if you unless you feel really confident. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck no! You saw what happened when I was doing this no, fucking fight. No. I was like. Uh, there's just a few uh, TXT files inside the app data roaming folder. The fun value can be altered in the notepad, and different values affect different events. But even with that in play, there's still additional RNG for the gaster door to appear, even if the value is correct. Hex editing data that. Uh, when to enable debug mode force all fun adventure crew regardless of value. How the hell did I still get hit by that? Whatever. Fuck mm -hmm. Nick, dodge the sands, opening attack completely sans. No, this isn't how you're supposed to play the game. The bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, yep. You gotta do the flashy stuff. Yeah, that attack I can never avoid! Or you have to go down one level to avoid the bones coming at ya. Okay, I need a question. How do you dodge this thing when he goes faster? Because for some reason, when he does it faster, I get hit still. Anyone knows how to tell me about that? I don't know, I just kind of hold the button. Like, I just go crazy with the buttons. I'm just like, nope, nope, nope. The noodle, so you have the full heal buffer for the last quarter attack. Well, yeah, because that, because that, yeah, that is the full heal item. I usually, or not, my items wrong, like, just regular heals and full heals. That way I don't accidentally spam and hit an item that I didn't want to use yet. Uh, three minutes, I just sort of hold it or guess, uh, or guess the direction. His arm, his arm dictates which direction it goes. Fair. Yeah, uh, that's, that's pretty much the best explanation I can give. Like, I just hold it. Like, there really is no better explanation for that. Ooh, that was close. That was really close. Oh, there goes the noodles. Those this little shit attack. You never know. Oh, well, I mean, he can't kill you in the menu, but it's better to kind of act fast because the bones do kind of hurt you and you take additional damage, so it's better to kind of act fast. Like, the, the the only thing that he can do in the menu is just bring you down to 1 HP. Yeah, but it's still, like, pretty bad. Yeah, it's still Ooh. pretty bad because you gotta get more damage from the menu. Everyone using all this tech target, and then there's me, like, this is hard. It, it is hard rocks, like, it is actually really hard, but the thing is, what I find pretty good in Undertale is that the more you die, the more you kind of memorize patterns. Like, in a way, it's kind of a, like, a lose-win situation. Like, yeah, you lost the fight, but to me, I find it a win because you kind of, like, get the feeling of how the battle works and memorize the pattern. Sadly, this is so, not the run, but you know what? It's cool. We had a good time. You, we, we got further, yeah. Like, you're, you're getting further. You're, yeah, like, I'm kind of glad that you did practice and you're kind of, like, getting the hang of it. That move still fucking sucks, though. Yeah! How does Sam do all this flashy stuff? Does he turn off the light? Uh, yeah. Sure. <laughs> he can't kill you in the menu. Yeah, he can, yeah. Yeah, he just drops you down to one, but yeah, it's still it's pretty. But it's still pretty annoying though when it happens. I'd be shocked if you beat him with less than ten deaths because Doubtful. my second run this, I it took me ten deaths to kill um, to kill him. So I'd be impressed if you actually beat my record. Doubt it. Uh, we'll see, because she got pretty far. Far as only horseshoes and hand grenades, Sheena. That was pretty damn close for the fourth run. It really was. Like, I'm really impressed. Especially that you're using the King Cube that you haven't really got practice on. Are you hitting the button too early? Ah! Uh, I don't know. Like, I don't think- I think you're doing just fine. It's just- That using... attack, I usually always just have, like, difficulties in dodging in general, to be honest. Like, cause I, really cause I notice like the, die. cause the bones don't, um, I don't know, I, 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 that attack is still kind of iffy for me to dodge, sadly. Yeah, even for me, like, when it's really fast like that, it's 
she's still kind of to take ship damage because it's going so fast that you had to kind of have to keep holding which whatever direction to avoid the bones from the wall. Oh, that <laughs> sucked. Oof. I usually stick to the bottom or the middle of the bottom, but I was trying to, but my heart, to... but my heart was like literally. <laughs> yeah, it, the, <laughs> it wanted to go up. They wanted to keep on going up. <laughs> Now I'm giving you my energy. <laughs> All the energy is needed. Yeah. <laughs> I remember my first time doing this. Like, like I was going in blind. Like, yeah, I like heard of the fight and all that, but doing the fight blind. Ugh. It took me days. Yeah, you know how those people say that, man, coding is easy. Then they actually do, it, and it's like, man, this is stupid. <laughs> it took me. Days to defeat Sans. Like, I don't know how many hours total, but let's just say probably like. Actually, that's probably not a very good analogy. I should probably say, you know how those people say that, oh man, Guitar Hero teach me how to play guitar. <laughs> and then they actually play real guitar. It's like, man, it's nothing like that. <laughs> no, it was not. Like, I don't know how many hours total for me of trying to defeat Sans, but all you know is that it took me like almost a week just to get past him. Like, I tried for like an hour or two and trying to. Sands. That was an hour and still nothing. I'm like, ah, break time. We're phase there two. Cause there were times where I got really frustrated. I'm like, my fingers need to break. My fingers need to break. Yes, they need breaks. <sighs> Sans is smearing you. That's nice, except I don't feel like getting dunked on. Fuck you. <laughs> Once more. Why do I keep getting hit by that? Are you getting hit by the blue bone? I don't know. I'm clearly dodging it, but the game is like saying, <laughs> "No, you're not." No, I mean you dodged that one though. Yeah. I think I think you kind of win. No, the deep. The, see, the problem with the D-pad for the GameCube is that it's small as shit. So, you know, just a little bit of a tap can actually just screw you over. Yep. That's why I don't use the control stick, because I rather have more precise jumps when I'm using the D-pad instead of using the control stick. I learned coding one, then immediately forgot everything because it was nothing to do with my major. Oh, what are you majoring in, Rock? If I may ask. Like, if you don't want to tell, that's fine. <laughs> Hand me the AUX cord. <laughs> Yeah, my second time doing this fight, it took me 10 bass, so, which will be too bad. Actually, I actually did my LP, so, me. But I gotta lie, like, even though this fight is hard, it's still kind of fun to do at the same time. It, it's, it's more so, not, not, not fun, like, in a fun way, but it's more so thrilling fun. Like, yeah, like, genocide is, like, you no, know, it's, like, terrible and boring and all that, but... Undyne and Sans are actually pretty fun to fight, not gonna lie. No, Undyne can kiss my ass. <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I first Sans fight over Undyne's. Undyne is bullshit. Threw her yellow spheres to death. Hate those spheres. Game development. To be more specific, cost of design, I'm looking to be a concept artist for video game. Ooh, that sounds pretty good. You know, yeah, like, uh, concept design, that's really like, Video games, that's actually pretty cool. Hey, like, yeah, I mean, coding's not like one of them. I mean, it could be part of it, maybe, if you're doing like, I guess, 3D models. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how that works exactly. The concept design is actually pretty neat. Zip. There you go. All right. You can do it. Unfortunately for healing to kind of like... No, no. Um, we're at the final part. Here we go. Oh, boy. Oh, sure, you're at the end already. I told you we were at the end. Fucking 
help. God damn it. Uh, uh, yeah, that's a thing. I, mean, you're kinda, I, think I you should have just used the. Buried. I should have just used the controller stick for that. Yeah, I was like for that part. Probably use the controller. Yeah, the controller I'm stick. just gonna use the controller stick for that because <sighs> I really did have yeah. it there. Yeah, really. you really did. It, like for me, like when I use the GameCube, I kind of switch in between. It just it's kind of hard to predict what attack he's gonna do next. But half most of the time he's the deep half of that. So the very last attack, I kind of like tend to like after he drags you to the other side of the of the wall, I go back to control stick or to the control stick. But that's just me. Fair enough. Like uh, yeah, after like he after you when he drags you, or, yeah, before, yeah, before he, he drags you, that's when I switch to control stick. But, I don't know. Uh, Korean 3D models don't actually require coding. Oh, okay. Fuck you, you're Play blue block. spears! <laughs> Not spears, you blue bones! <laughs> uh. I think this was my first run of this in years, and I was one short of the final attack. We sort of synced up halfway together. Nice. <laughs> we are so close. For the fifth round, that was pretty good. It was, it was pretty good. He could have had it, but... Tension rising. Tension rising. Anger's filling. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you for flubbing six. Yeah, that seems kind of like the usual thing that happens. Like, you get really close and then all of a sudden you, all of a sudden you start to mess up really bad again. I hate that. About to mess up the stupid shit too. Oh, you, oh, you dodged that. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, first, so. I'm... I did this as a first blind run, and to this day, I have no idea how. I don't know how either. Experiment that sounds like crazy godlike power you did. Like, I'm not gonna lie, like. I think you're, you, you do better in this fight than I do. Platforming, man. <laughs> you're, you're good at platforming, like these. I mean, it's kind of what I treat it as, for the most part. I mean, the fight is treated as a platformer, so yeah. When you can get really close, your mind is still distracted by the last hurdle. Yeah. Yeah, because you're more so, you're so, you, you get so, like, defeated that, you know, you, that could have been the run, but then you start doing stupid shit. <laughs> That's usually how it is when you're doing hard battles. Like, you, like you get really close and all of a sudden you start to mess up because that mind is still there, but like, man, I had it. I had it. <laughs> and now I don't have it. <laughs> no, I don't have it. Yeah, because this part, I kind of, like, sometimes I do just stand or go to the other side of that small platform that you're standing in. But you, you just jump through it. I'm like, I can't do that. Yeah. Yep. You know, I feel sorry for wallflowers, and I um, can relate to them. They tend to get ignored by a complete accident a lot. It's like they're invisible without uh, actually being invisible. Well, I mean, I mean, yeah, that's true, but also at the same time, that you know, they don't really say much to get noticed. So? It's kind of, you know, wallflowers. They tend to be ignored or, you know, uh, introverted in a way. Well, you know, you kind of have to, like, kind of take it a step at a time and kind of, you know, get yourself out there, kind of be noticed in a way. Like, I, I, like, like, even for introverted people, they can still technically, you know, um, get noticed. It's just, they have their own way of trying to get noticed. I think it's a missed opportunity to not blank out this fight, Borders. <laughs> Here we go! I couldn't tell if you got hit there or not. I got hit, trust me. Okay, I, 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 I actually saw that I got hit. I don't know if you're still taking damage from like previous hits or something. No, I got hit. 
Yeah, that's not true. Yep, here we go. Like, against Asriel, it was just a waste of space because of the cool trick he did with the background, but here it's just you and the funny bone man. <laughs> <laughs> it's just you and the funny bone. You and the funny bone. Yeah, because Asriel has like that cool background in this fight, but yeah, I was like, nah, <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna fight in the darkness. <laughs> Roxas, if you win, he'll give you 200. 200 what? $200. Alright. That means I won't win then. Cause you just bet- oh. Cause you just bet in money on it. So that means I automatically lose. Well dang. That's how it goes, right? <laughs> Woo! I think it's more so you keep- you keep getting hit by that attack that you kinda jumped into early. Well, it's stupid, I, I hate it. I, I know that you jumped early for that attack. Okay, I'm gonna explain this shit. Why do I keep getting uh, hit by this? Why? It's really hard because it's so fast. <gasps> I don't, like, I'm not surprised you're getting hit by those, because those things go really fast. Like, it's really hard to kind of... Like, oh my really god, gotta that's like the, the only... <laughs> like, you hate. really gotta hold down the direction. I really hate that damn attack, I swear. Rock said, I promise, but I don't make promises I can't keep. God damn it. Ugh. Ah. Ugh. Ugh. If I can figure out how to dodge the stupid slamming double one that he does, then I can probably beat his ass, but I always get hit at that I section. I don't even think control stick will work. Like, I don't know if about beating the control stick will help. Because I even find that weird when I try to use it. It's so weird how fans fight you in the dark too because this is the one of the only other areas in the game with a dynamically open world but it's pitch black in the battle screen. Mm-hmm. Man, sometimes whenever he does that attack, I never even realize what the hell I'm getting hit by. <laughs> <laughs> dynamically lit. Like, I think the easier attack to avoid is pretty much the short hop ones. In my own honest opinion, but that's just me. Man, you wanna know what I miss? I wish he stopped doing them damn blue attacks and the damn blue attack sucks. <laughs> well, he's a skeleton with no standards at all. <laughs> What's with the blue bones? Um, it's the blue bones pretty much, um, for blue attacks, um, you don't move at all. If you're moving while blue passes through you, you will take damage. Blue attack pretty much. You don't want to move during those, so... And that's why he doesn't use orange, because he ain't stupid. <laughs> well, yeah, orange basically just, like, gotta keep moving. Yeah, which will make sense to be able to move against that one attack, because he ain't dumb. <laughs> He's like, uh-uh, I, I, I know what happens if I do that attack. You you end up winning. Can't have that. Hey, Trevor! Yo, Trevor, how's it be happening? Oh, hey. Yo, is this the game that Meat Gunner is from? Yes. <laughs> know it. He's good. That's good. That's good. Yes, there's an X. Mm hmm Yeah, that's what I do. I usually stick to the bottom of the middle. If I had to switch from the middle to the bottom, then I do so. Because the top is actually kind of kind of hard to like avoid. Because getting down is the hard part. Yeah, because you go to the top, you're pretty much fucked. Mm-hmm, because you gotta avoid those platforms if you want to get down. And Trevor said he's just doing some stuff. Cool. Kind of stuff. Kind of stuff. Yep. Funny oversight with orange attack, there is actually one frame where you can't take damage from that color pattern, and it's when you change directions. Yeah. Cause it, when you're, cause you have that moment of pause when you're changing direction, so I can see why you would get hit by that. Yeah, that's why I keep getting hit by blue attacks. Because that one frame where you're actually moving. Yeah. Man, I can believe that. Type of I can bullshit. believe that. <laughs> yeah. Like you have to be like pixel perfect to avoid. Uh, he says he's on the verge of recording custom robot for the Oh, nice. Oh, 
the way. We're still. I completely <laughs> forgot. <laughs> We should technically stop moving in one direction according to the game's coding. Yep, uh, uh, I can believe that. That sounds like a reasonable answer. Like, I definitely believe that. Did you have that like that split second where you stop just to turn around? Hmm. Yeah. Oof. There you go. Nice. Pretty good there. Yes. Keep talking, Sheena. Don't stop I know, talking. I'm, I'm, I know. I'm, I'm trying not to talk. You know or, what happens? I'm, I'm trying to talk. I'm, I'm trying to keep talking. I'm trying to come up with conversations. You know what happens during the Undying fight? We got a content I know, ID. I, 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 I learned from that. I'm trying to... Man, you can do that perfectly. Where you're going through that hall of bones right there. You can do that perfectly. Yeah, I, I wish I can actually do the. Yeah, and then I get hit. Yeah, well, <laughs> well, I get hit. <laughs> Are you sure? I should keep talking. Keep talking. It's fine. Right. I actually yeah. like you talking. Remember, you were talking before when I was doing this fight. It's fine. I know. Well, I mean, kind of. I was actually just reading dialogue from the game. That's fine. <laughs> that also helped. <laughs> I, 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 I like I like reading the dialogue. I know you like reading the dialogue. I so, so I, I I like it. I, I like reading the dialogue too. Heat. So what's like with pizza? My favorite deep dish. What's yours? Ooh, I like pan. I like when they're big the and not much of a deep dish portion. How did I? Okay, hold on. How come I didn't get hit by that one? I saw <laughs> that. I'm. Uh, all right, fuck you. Okay, game. Thin, like thin pizza, Trevor. I don't mind thin. I'm more so of a thick crust person, but I don't mind thin. It really depends on the how, like how thin it is. Like I don't like it when it's too like crunchy in a way. Thicker. <laughs> stuff crust. Ooh, I like stuff crust. Stuff is good. Chicken bacon rancho. <laughs> thick and stiff. This attack. Can kiss Ooh. my ass. Uh, you know, breaking into this game's files and learning about all gaster related stuff makes you see Sion go from haha funny bone friend to who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, you got the end? Yeah. Alright, here we go. Okay. See how you do this one. Yeah, oh. I don't even know where you- are you saying D-pad or trust it? I changed it. Okay. See how it goes. Don't get too close to them. Oh, don't get too close. Yes! Yes! Oh! I did it! Yes! How many deaths was that? I don't know! Is anybody keeping, is anybody keeping count? Because I don't know how many deaths was that. Yes! Holy crap. Booyah! Cool. Practice makes perfect. <laughs> I think I think you beat my record. <sighs> oh my <laughs> uh, Jesus. The experiment's about six or seven tries? That took me ten tries. You beat me. Uh, now kill his ass. Seven, at least said. Man, lucky number seven. Oh really? <laughs> Booyah! <laughs> <laughs> And now we gotta wait till he actually falls asleep yeah, because he keeps yeah, blinging me wait. back into the middle for some reason, which I don't understand how that works. Cool. I was afraid for that last one because you were really close to the Gaptor Blasters. <sighs> like, don't get too close because I make that mistake all the time during that part. I always get, too, I'm always too close to the, the beams. Hoig! I can take off my glasses now because that's it. That's actually the end Ooh. of the genocide route. That's so much the end, yeah. Cause... Except for you know the very last part. Well, Asgore dies and Flowey gets fucking mutilated. Oh, me. We still got we still got plenty of time to finish off the rest of the genocide, of course. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Uh, actually, I kind of want the I want the chat to decide the faith of Frisk. I'm not gonna really decide it because I don't. It's not my file, anyways. True. Oh yeah, yeah. Cause you don't really have to like see it complete it. <laughs> yeah, cause I'm pretty much I, I'm pretty much done. Yeah, you're pretty much done. You know. I just wanted to, <laughs> just wanted to just get through all of this. Oh it. man, I'm actually glad it did yeah. not take that long. How many minutes was that? 
I think you started like at 9.26 for me, so roughly an hour. Or no, not not even an hour, like 30 minutes? Oh, no, 40, 40. Like, I would say 45 roughly. <sighs> Rocks us do the jump scare. I, I mean, I'm fine with that. Like, I don't like jump scares, but um, I, I know about the jump scare, so I'm good with that. Oh, that segment? Oh. What? How do you, how do you get that? Is that... Um... I think when you say no, I believe. Oh, okay, yeah, because um, that's when um, characters. <laughs> that's yeah, that's it. Go home. Phew. Did a third go. Still got it. So after the laser, did Sans really just bang you against the wall until you got tired? Mm -hmm. Yes. He pretty much like. Let's do the jump scare. Uh, delete for us can never touch this file ever again. Uh, Rock says say no. Yeah, that's the say no option. Okay. What are you doing with the jump scare? So that is deleting Frisk, right? Because that is then... Yeah, that's pretty much deleting Frisk, I believe. Alright, well, then we'll be done. Then I guess the chat says we'll delete Frisk. That... Then we... That fr then... Be 10 minutes for that. 10 minutes? Happen. Yeah, the thing to happen. Oh, I don't know. Lord. Is it 10 minutes? I think I think it's 10 minutes to wait for the thing to happen. To, like, to fully, fully reset the thing, I mean. Because if you go back to the game, you kind of stick stick in this black screen. Fair enough. <laughs> Don't bother bringing the game back to delete for us and go play Super Kirby Clash. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what I would do. Uh, and there goes Sans. And there goes... <laughs> now he's going to go become... No, it's fine. This is canon. Because uh, you know why? Now he's going to go to Smash Brothers. <laughs> well... Oh, don't worry. This is not the real Sans. It's just a me in that costume. Ah, <laughs> shit. We killed Frisk. <laughs> oh, no. Now Frisk will never be in Smash. And he dies off screen. Yeah. Now that's what you call a bunny bone, Kappa. Da 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 da. <laughs> when you die, you go to Smash Brothers. Okay, so all the characters in Smash, they all die in their own game. Gotcha. I mean, you can die in every single of their games, so... I mean, technically, technically, they did die in Ultimate, so... Yeah. Bye-bye <laughs> me, Gunner. And now I'm level 99. And now for one... What What'd I say? You said level 99. Yeah, I know. Why did you say that for? You're silly. <laughs> he cut his arm off and then he goes to Sakurai's house. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> you can't dynamo crossing their Pokemon. <laughs> uh, but you can get, I guess, worn out, stung by bees. I don't know. It's as comfortable as it looks. Yeah, we pretty much are possessed at this point. Cool. Mm -hmm. You have no state of mind at all. Oh uh, yeah, the line that um, uh, San says that what do you want? Um, papyrus, and then he fades. Yep, yeah. I'm like, oh, I see it. He said that. Mm hmm. <laughs> I guess even worse. Curious. I've never seen a plant cry before. Yo, what's up? Huh? You must You're gonna die! One. You must be the one that Flower just warned me about. Howdy. Um, kind of monster or you? Sorry, I cannot tell. I don't have my glasses, apparently. Well, oh, uh, well, okay. Always. Now, now, there's no need to fight. Why not settle this over a nice cup of tea? And uh, no. So the sand just go to this illusion before he died? Maybe. Why, you... Why, you little... Asgore, welcome to die. Pretty much. <laughs> I was like, well, that was a that was a riveting fight. Yeah, yeah. See, I never betrayed you. <laughs> I was waiting to kill him for you. After all, it's me, your best friend. I'm helpful. I I promise I won't get in your way. I can help. I can I can Please. And now it's and this is Azrael talking. Funny enough, because yeah, the because the text sound is different. Mm -hmm. And that's it. Well, I had like no input for that, and uh, that's it. They, 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 there you go. He's uh, mm -hmm. he's, he, he's dead now. By the way, um, check on the um the musical version of this scene, and it's uh 
It's a lot it's worse. Pretty, yeah, it's, they go into detail with that. Yeah, they go into detail sound, with that. The, 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 with the sound. Greetings. I so much stuff you don't even register am to Kara. Thank, Thank you. you. No, I'm the devil. Your power awakened me from death. <laughs> my kill stealer. There is kill stealer. Human soul. My determination. They were not mine, but yours. At first, I was so confused. Our plan had failed, hadn't it? Why was I brought back to That's life? That's clever. That's clever. Hold on. Uh, Lisa said, Lisa said, I like how Flowey stealthily kills a soul so you can't go to the surface. Oh, huh, that's a good point. Asgore's soul. Yeah, that is, I did not notice that, huh? With your riots, I realize the purpose of my reincarnation. Power. Together, we are eradicate the enemy and become strong. HP, attack, defense, gold, experience, level. Actually, Every there will be on this particular sequence. Time so the number out. increases that feeling. That's me, Kara. Flowers accidentally now, to reach you. Now we have reached the absolute. Not that it means much in the end. Yeah, that's true. There is nothing left for us here. Let us erase this pointless world and move on to the next. Ah, uh, what are we doing again? I forgot. What the hell are we doing? Uh, you say do not. No? Hmm. How curious. You must have misunderstood. Since when were you the one in control? Ah! <laughs> oh no, my, my TV Back screen off. has died. <laughs> Back off, fiend. And that's the end of the genocide route. Da 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 da. <laughs> Ten minutes later. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. That's it. The game kind of just ends there. I yeah. forgot because we're kind of pretty much dead. Dead? Yeah. Uh, I mean dead. I don't know why I said dead. Uh, anyways, um, that's it. We managed to complete every route on stream. And... Uh, that's your way to end Undertale and also apparently quote-unquote celebrate the fourth anniversary of Undertale by killing everybody. <laughs> Okay, listen. I listen. I didn't think that was the first. on Sunday, okay? Yeah, okay. That that's not my issue. I didn't expect it to be the fourth anniversary. I didn't even know when the first anniversary was even gonna hit. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it just coincidentally just falls on a Sunday. I'm like, oh, well, that's actually kind of fitting. So yeah, that's it right now. I'm actually the stream will actually end early this time because uh, I guess when Sunday hits. Um, Friday, we will be starting, um, what is it? Uh, we will be, no, no, sun, uh, I said Friday? No, no. Friday, we'll be starting Link's oh, Awakening okay. Remake, and, um, Sunday, we'll be starting Deltarune, finally, because... Did you say for tomorrow, you're gonna be starting... Oh, yeah, and tomorrow will be Final Fantasy Seven. um... The original, obviously. I don't know why I'm saying the original for it. It's like, obviously. The well, well, fast jump scare was lame. It wasn't really much of a fast jump scare. It was like a slow moving jump scare. So it wasn't. Yeah, if it was, if it was like really scary, it probably would have been like one that kind of just flashes to Which the jump I scare. Can't take. Yeah, I, I can't know. Fast ones. I actually thought the jump scare was actually going to be a little one where it's just go back. But no, I didn't do that. It was actually kind of yeah. that was actually kind of lame, to be honest. But anyways, um, not a place stance and smash. <laughs> um, but no, and I want to honestly thank you guys for joining us for this final session of Undertale Genocide Route. When we come back, we will be heading finally into Delta Rune, and I have Yay. no clue. What Deltarune Good. has to offer, because I had Good. never seen anything of it. The only thing I've seen it was the 
second meme guy who I'm assuming is Jivel or Jevil or whatever the hell his name is. I only listened to his theme and that was it. So if that says anything, <laughs> there goes that. <laughs> but whatever. Anyways, um, we will catch you guys next time and you guys have yourselves a wonderful night. See us later. Jizzle. Did <laughs> you just end it with Jizzle? Okay, fine, whatever. That's fine. And I stopped the recording.